our 17 uh, female team, women team of Nigeria, the Flamingos will be playing Colombia uh, at the semi-final of under 17 men's World Cup in India. Nigeria, they have met Colombia two times and this one now is the third time they are meeting Colombia. The first one they met Colombia was in, was in September, uh, September 2012, 2012 uh, Nigeria defeated Colombia three goes to nothing and also the next time they met nigeria met colombia was in 2014 also of under, under 17 women's world cup nigeria also defeated colombia 2-1 so head to head nigeria is ahead of colombia so nigeria have defeated them two times in their two meetings so this is the third meeting so in that regard nigeria stand the chance of still beating colombia again for the third time at the semi-final and progress to the final but before we conclude on that nigeria this this uh Colombian forward Linda Caicedo is a player to what Nigeria you know defenders must be very very careful of that player I know Usani is good in the defense Usani uh, Edafe they are very strong well, you know, well built and that defense but they must be careful of Linda Caicedo's tactics and invasion uh, into their 18 yard boss Linda Caicedo she's already the top scorer in this uh, tournament she scored four goals and one is an own goal of course it must be credited to her she has five goals now to her credit so nigerian defenders must be very careful very very careful of linda kaiseido on the nigerian side we also have players like ajakaye we have uh, belo we have uh, Afolabi, we have so many you know promising talents that could really cause a big problem to the colombian defense like i mentioned in my previous video nigeria played new zealand and they had 17 shots on target and just four were goals they played chile as well the same 17 shots on target they were able to score just two. so if they should really work on their shooting accuracy you know nigeria will defeat colombia with ease because the nigerian players they create a lot of chances and converting you know finishing became a problem but i know the tactics the coach deployed you know against usa because usa players they were more tactical and they and they just played so well they, you know, the defense was okay the defended and defended and defended and in the end nigeria won on penalty but you know you cannot play the same tactics the same style in every match you might even you, of course you should expect a different approach from your opponent so of course the way usa played and nigeria of course may not be the way colombia will play nigeria so i believe the coach has a lot a lot of pep talk a lot to do to his team. I know Nigeria on Wednesday 28th, the, the match between Nigeria and Colombia will be on Wednesday 26th of uh, October 2022. That's three days from now. So, and that, that the, the time uh, is going to be 12 noon, 12 noon Nigerian time and 4 30 pm Indian time. So, Nigeria has all it takes to beat Colombia again for the third time and progress to the first ever finals of the under 17. World Cup if they are able to make good use of your of their chances so you don't get a lot of chances at semi-finals you they've got a lot of that during their uh, you know, uh, qualifying stages they got I mean you got 17 shots on target and just few of them were goals but of course this is semi-final and this, this is knockout stage so you don't get a lot of that, th those chances and then you squander them so of course by this time in fact they have they have got a lot a lot of time to prepare you know, to work on themselves work on their shooting accuracy I believe by Wednesday you know 26th of October 2022 they must have finished all the practice done all the necessary training and I know I know they are going to come out with you know the best approach you know having more ball control you know they still having issues with ball control I don't know that to, to, to attribute it to the fact that you know they are match against USA before then I think that was rainfall and all that but then when you look at the way USA players were playing uh, players like um, uh, Romero Gamero excuse me oh my god you're wondering if something is working on this lady's leg they played you know with expertise they played with some kind of uh, you know courage some kind of uh, uh, wonderful skill i can say but i know of course nigerian the carry last i know our ladies really so high they are going to defeat colombia and whether it's germany or spain whosoever that was nigeria once nigeria gets the final i you know trust them and i believe they are definitely going to win it this time so all the best i wish you guys the flamingos the best and go again this time and defeat Colombia and progress to the final. Once Colombia is defeated, Nigeria has no hurdle again. They have almost laid their hands on the trophy. Thank you guys.